Welcome everybody, we are live today. We're playing Drowning Cross. Which is a narrative game. There's a hole inside you. I'm aware. <laughs> oh, that that was not the best timing for that. Nothing eases the pain. You don't want to let it hurt others. This game does not have a title screen. It, you just jump right in. But sometimes it does. Okay. So we're playing Drowning Cross. It's a narrative game. I believe it's free on Steam. It was a dollar on Switch. Uh, so you can buy it for a dollar. In fact, we're going to play two games today because I know this game's not. Um... Oh, they're talking without me. Uh, we're going to play two games today because I know this game's not long. Uh, but they're both a dollar. So it's dollar day, essentially. Your buddy tried to take you home earlier. Leo was here? Yeah, you kind of blew him off in a bad way. Hmm. I don't remember that. That's not surprising at all. Okay, well, let's see what's gonna happen here. Well, damn, I better go home. Good plan, see you tomorrow morning, Jeremy. Jeremy? Oh, we can't be good. We can't be a good person if our name is Jeremy. <sighs> okay. Look. Hey, Jack. On a scale of 0 to 10, how drunk was I tonight? Solid 8. Barely able to control body functions or form proper words. Been entertaining for us, but for your little buddy, probably not so much. Use. I can't use? Oh, it won't let me use. Is alcohol both a blessing and a curse? I'm not sure I'm into moderate drinking. That doesn't nearly help as much with certain things though. But at least you won't need a barf bucket. Haven't needed one since my late 20s. Leo. Leo. This doesn't talk. Oh, each button does something different. Thinking about my man Leo. Looking at this won't help. Uh, save game? Sure. Kind of want to tuck his shirt in properly. To jack our foreman. Okay. Yep, that's a pretty big one. Got to work those big bolts somehow. I use it to take the means of productions back from our capitalist overlords. Now that's the one. I'll just put it back in the toolbox. I'm gonna smash the patriarchy with it. One and three are good. Two is the lame one. Uh, let's go. Let's go for the capitalists. Not literally big enough for that. Yeah, you're probably right. Okay. Bags. This stuff is for building protection. It goes all gross and slimy men when mixed with water. It's me. I'll put on weight again. Powder fuck. <gasps> they say the bad word. Fucking burns when you breathe it in. Gotta keep a safe distance. I hate slapping this stuff on walls that burns. Okay. Can we leave? Yeah. Okay. Building. This is going to be a boring building for a boring logistics company. I've seen enough of this place during working hours today. Hey, don't go anywhere while I'm gone. 
It's nothing but a huge monstrosity. Like looking up a lot while fondling, like looking at a light, like looking up a lot while fondling a joystick, then consider a career as a crane driver. Hi Crane, how's it hanging? Because it hangs stuff. Hey, there's some rope. Neat. Okay, took the rope. Doesn't seem to. Oh, a tree? Its leaves are gently rustling in the wind. I would hug this tree, but I feel guilty doing so because we're doomed. Because we've doomed the planet. Sorry for all the pollution and the upcoming extinction of the bees. <gasps> bees. The game involves bees. That's the connection. Dollar bees. Oh no. Oh, is this Leo's car? Well, he did crash at the beginning. We did see that. We saw that with our eyes. I already forgot. It's Leo's car, but... Where is he? It's empty. Why didn't he just come back and ask for help? It's not going anywhere anytime soon. We're gonna have to tow it. Check front. The key's not in the ignition. There's nothing else of note. Check back. There are Bluetooth speakers tumbling around in the back. Big speakers. Got them. Check. I guess that's it. Yeah, you, you better be okay. Okay. Leo can't just be gone, he's gotta be nearby. I should go home and make some calls. It's a tiny dog? Pretty sure she's just another tenant like me. It doesn't seem like she needs help crossing the street yet. Evening? Good evening. Uh, does your fuzzy boy here not want to sleep? Actually, it's me who couldn't sleep. That always happens when I have one of my lazy days. Felix just likes to tag along. Uh, I'm door number nine. I'm 21. That's one of the big ones, right? Almost too big for me. I never expected to be living alone. But I still have my little Felix. You want to switch apartments? Well, of course not, you silly goose. Okay. At the dog. Does the doggy want some cuddles? Good boy. I guess we can't pet him. It is it is very rude when people pet dogs. Like Rack. Empty because the bikes keep disappearing. There are no bikes to nab. Bike freedom is only one bolt cutter away. There are a lot of dog poop bags in there. We have very responsible dog owners here. That's good. I jump in the in there because I'm trash, but it's too small. Hi, I am like the things you contain. Trash. Very relatable content. Okay. It's quite creaky, clunky thing. Heady it up says a tiny voice in the back of my mind, but no. I like storage space. This was a gaming PC once. Now it's struggling even with internet browsing. I I feel you so hard. <laughs> I feel you so hard on that. Looks like Leo was searching for the picture of an angel statue online. Angel statue.
relic from a long lost time. I want to smash it open and touch the yellow mess inside it. I have done that before. It's just wax. It's just wax. This doesn't feel that great, honestly. Whose socks are hanging out of the drawer? Mine, of course. I feel fine, actually. Oh. But there's a better way to take this picture with me than carrying it around. That's so nice. It's Leo and me in the park, selfieing like the millennials we are. We're still pay uh, paying a tiny sum every month for this TV. We love you <laughs> to the TV. It's not TV time now. Leo's work wallet. He's working at the Big Fox earlier today. I could check if he's there. Keeps high keeper of money. I'll leave it here. And we need to make some calls. Wet, wet trousers. Leo's trousers are wet. He must have stopped by not too long ago. Right through my boyfriend's trousers feels weird, but... This is a special situation. There's a key for Leo's workplace logger in there. Coming with me now. Okay. I guess we go to wherever we need to go to. Okay, we have the key to the locker, a rope, a white sock, a Bluetooth speaker. Well, he's a big guy. Hey, what's up? Um, nice summer night. Yeah, watching out for creeps is nicer when it's not freezing cold. Summer. I'm looking for Leo. Yeah, I get that a lot. Really? Well, never mind. What's he to you? My partner, he's kind of disappeared after an accident. Uh, okay, listen. I'm not sure if I should. He's living with me. Look, I don't know you. I just don't want to send anyone weird after him, okay? Show me some proof you're with him, then we can talk. Okay, fine. Okay, we didn't we didn't bring the picture. Can I use as proof? Can I use the key as proof? Let's use the key. This isn't helping. Um, do I not have a phone or something? He's a co-worker of Leo. I'm sure I can get with him to help me. Use the rope. Does it help me?
Like a machine for cans, he even gives you some money back. Thank you for your efforts. He only eats cans, not humans. He is still going. Okay, so I, I'm missing something. I thought the picture would be proof, but no. This might not be as short of a playthrough if I can't figure out the first literal puzzle. Oh, there we go. There's the phone. Thing really should have taken with me today. My phone. Okay. Sorry about the car. I gotta do a thing. Hard to explain later. Okay. It's not picking up. I really don't like this. Where is he? So the phone should be proof. If this isn't helping, how is it not helping? So confused now. I check what Twitter has to say about lazy capitalism, but no data plan. Was there something to the right, actually? No. We can recycle it. Find three cans. Would there be a point to go to the front, go back to the car?
that then. That then. What if I take a picture? There we go. Okay. That we would physically take the picture, but no. It's best to just take a picture of the picture, I guess. That's not what I would have done. <laughs> I would have brought the entire picture with me. Hey look, this is Leo and me. It's from last summer. Hey nice, didn't know Leo had a partner. He left earlier today, but I have no idea where he went. But feel free to go inside and ask around. Okay. Looks like she's managing the bar all on her own tonight. I'm sure she prefer non-groping customers. Hi. Evening, what can I get you? Is it always this uh, empty? Well, it's typical Thursday night. Most of them have already shambled home. They gotta get at least a few hours of sleep in before work. Uh, I'm looking for Leo. He didn't come home tonight and I got a weird text from him. Oh, so you're the mysterious boyfriend. I wasn't certain you actually er, exist. But I did hear stories. Nice to meet you. Uh, but he didn't come home. That's weird. Yeah, did he mention anything strange tonight? He wanted to grab a bite before driving his drunk BF home. That be that's you, probably. Yes, he tried to, apparently. Okay, that's all I know, though. Sorry. A man, a working man, a working drinking man. He's having a date with alcohol. No need to butt in. I too am very fond of alcohol. I could put 15 beers in me within a short time frame. You're just nibbling away at the glass. Looks like you can't keep up with me. Will you respect me now and value my horrible concept of masculinity? I did not care. So many drinks it says to ask about cocktails because they can't list them all. Free lighters with the bar logo on them. Don't need potential forest fires. Okay, we took the box lighter. Yo, hey, uh, that's an employee only area. The facilities aren't around the other way if you need them. Okay, so we can't go there. We may need to distract. It's a piping. The old rusty pipe. Are they doing repairs? have 
a thought about cocktails. Oh, what if we ask about cocktails? Hey, you do cocktails, right? Yep, what you want? What's the most horrible yet tastiest cocktail you can make? Uh, oh, probably the Romo's Gin Fizz. Lots of gross milk products and eggs in there. Yeah, that sounds terrible and good, just the way I like it. It's really expensive, though. Hmm, I see. Please. Gotta take a while, though. Have a seat or something. Uh, I feel sort of bad about this. Better be generous with the tip. Okay. Can I get back here right now? Yes. What's this? Across in the forest. And that woman on the picture looks like Leo's late mother. He'll take the picture of his mom and across to his locker door. Where did Leo go to grab a bite? The only place that's still open that grows burger place around the corner. Toro Burgers or something. Okay. Looks like she's writing something. Good evening. Hi. Are you writing something? Yeah, I keep revising this paragraph, but it only it just doesn't feel right. Not gonna stop until it clicks. Can you work in a place like this? It's fine, I like the occasional distractions. The background noise helps me focus. Maybe because it makes me feel like I'm not alone. Newspaper cup. Okay. So paper cup. Ooh, we have a lot of things. Now with extra chunky cow bits and his sad leaf of salad you got a bad carbs to protein ratio <laughs> okay. okay I'm gonna talk to employees here Oh, maybe I need to take a picture of the, uh... Of the, uh... Whatchamacallit? something that's been going through Leo's mind lately and now I want to know what's up with that too okay I 
me show her this. the stranger Uh, hey, have you seen the guy, this guy tonight? Oh, him? I have, yes. Twice, even. You've seen him twice? Yes, the first time he sat at the opposite table and ate a wrap or something. But the second time, well, that was kind of strange. Well, he tried to dry his jeans with some paper towels. He was wet and muddy all over. Like he'd fall into a river or something. What would you do if your boyfriend just disappeared? Did he say anything weird? And all you ha all you heard from him is a worrying text message. Oof, I'd send him an avalanche of texts and call him every five minutes until he picked up. I really dislike cryptic texts. They don't help. The point is to make you worry less or explain things if something's up. Hey, I hope you'll find your BF soon. Did he say anything weird? Not really. He asked me to search for someone online, though. Which I did. His phone didn't seem to work anymore. Then he just left. Uh, who's the person you asked... He asked you to find online. That was Jefferson Sinclair. I think he's a priest from somewhere nearby. Jefferson St. Clair. Okay, what if we go home? Or what, what if we ask her about him? My friend is... My friend Leo's missing. This is him. Oh yes, that wild young man with the leather jacket and the coxcomb. Is that what it's called? I have no idea, but I haven't seen him today. Okay. Let's see who this dude is. Hmm. He's doing his services in the church near the park. Did Leo go see him and what for? We've never gone to church before ever. Still not picking up? This phone really seems to be dead. Okay, let's also search. I'll search, but. Nope, okay, he doesn't make that connection. And let's go to church. Looks comfortable. I came here with Leo from time to time. I feel fine, actually. Dear Bench, I appreciate your existence. A uh, nice little palm, but what are these slimy patches floating around in it? I just over the pond so I can jump in if I ever catch on fire. Are there baby froggos in there? Can we pick them up with a paper cup? 
Got some pond water with slimy bits. Nice. Okay, I don't know if that's what I needed to do, but I did it. This piece of piping, right? We have a pipe for some reason. There was a thing here at some point. No feeling what mess right tonight. Dying hangers be empty pillars. Hey, where's the sad hairy man in the perpetual agony? They forgot to put him up there. Not crossing that line. Jefferson St. Clair presumed a dapper middle-aged dude. Picked up men in various places, but in church would be a first. Good evening, hello. What brings you into the house of God at this hour? I'm looking for my boy or friend. Oh, well, I'm not sure if I can help, but I'll try. Uh, this is my friend Leo. Have you seen him? No, I don't know him. Has he been to church lately? I doubt it. Well, our doors are always open, don't forget. Okay, so that's not useful. He's watching. There are wine stains on the altar cloth. I committed so many biblical sins already, let's not add more. There's no hope for salvation for me, is there? Hmm. Looking good with your dress and flowing hair. I feel like vandalizing something, but maybe not this old crusty statue. Probably going to hell, got any tits for escaping eternal damnation. Let's try the statue, maybe? Have you seen this woman or that cross before? Hmm. No, I haven't. I don't think I can. I don't think I can help you there. Okay, sorry for the trouble. I don't think there's anything for him then. Pond water. Pond water. Nope. <laughs> okay, altar. Hey, that's not part of the church's public area. to do let's save oh. 
What if we leave pond water on the altar? What if we burn it down? To do then. Sinclair was not much help. Let's go back. Take pictures for the insurance. We got the wrench. Can we combine the wrench and the pipe? Nope. I need a distraction to make the the priest look away from the door. When you get near the door, you can closer. I don't know what could that be. Let's just talk to him again. I 
just need to put together a quick sermon for tomorrow morning. At least the hours are flexible. You want socks? Their car crash and I'm looking for him. I haven't seen anyone with that name tonight, sorry. Will we pray? Will that happen? Nope. <laughs> what if we ask about St. Clair? Let's ask around about him. Maybe this is where the drunk dude comes in handy. You know when I said this was going to be quick? Turns out when you're not very good at video games, not going to be quick at all. Let's talk about Sinclair. Oh, I don't think we asked him about the picture, though. Nope. Oh, wow. What else can I do? What can be done? Go to Burger Place. about my friend uh. how do you feel about wrenches what if I poked you Can I phone Sinclair? I think I tried that, but I don't remember. Let's ask the woman about Sinclair. It's disappeared after car crash and I'm looking for him. Oh, no wonder you're running around like an agitated chicken. I'm not sure who your friend is. you know about this. Have you seen this woman or the cross before? Oh, oh my, do you know her? Well, not personally, but that's Lena, Lena Joskova. She used to live near the forest in this old house, but something happened to her, I'm not sure what. There was a big hubbub around her burial proceedings. Her husband is also gone now. He came back a few times, each time more desolate. Do you know their son, Leo? No, I only know that they had a child from the obituaries I collect them. The house belongs to their son now, I think. Thanks. If this is about Leo's parents, he might have gone to his old place. My best lead so far. Okay. Old house. Very run down. Words. Um, I'm going to horse without a good reason. Old place isn't looking so good. Repairing it would be a monumental, expensive task. Housing should have people living in them. Or they get like this. 
Door is locked. There's a big crack near the lock area. It's locked. I'm most likely not going to open easily. I'll force you open if I have to. I mean, we could wrench it. It's blocked by cupboard or something. The glass is gone, but it's blocked by furniture. You're broken and need a repair. Okay, so... Opening... There's a loose plank down there. like it's not coming off that easily. The only thing I can think of that would actually do anything is this wrench. Never underestimate the power of leverage. Me owner of crusty plank. Use the crusty plank. It's just tying together where I actually need. Break into a house. Oh no, that worked. I almost did it, but I guess even this this wrench isn't big enough. I need something else. We wrench the cupboard. I missed a little piece of dialogue. That's fine. It's locked and most likely not going to open. <gasps> Nothing happened to the pipe because the pipe is gone. Stuck like a pipe piece into the crack. at work it's got to work out okay so we somehow I don't entirely know what we did empty save for a few boxes which are also empty looks like old dusty Graham is holding it together Newspaper ads. I had to cancel all abandonment. Rebels. It's a reference to the photo 
of the cross Leo had. It looked like it's nearby in the forest. Great. Way past midnight, I hate dark forests. I gotta find Leo. Spooky. Uh, we'll just keep going up. Marking the paths with socks. down. Okay, I think if it's the wrong path, it'll... No, because it that stayed. I don't. Oh, wait, go back. Where's that branch more? Root sticking out of the Mark more than one path, I just fuck even more. Okay.
I don't really understand. I think I need to find the right path. But... So this is the wrong one. There we go. Would you look at that? It's across from Leo's picture. Or maybe. Things need to find their way everywhere. Okay. Right, reach. Uh, rope. Plank. Uh, what's this? Old newspaper. To do here. This picture shows that they used to be a statue attached to the cross. There used to be a statue attached to the cross. So there be something more I could do here before I leave.
be a statue like that. This doesn't really seem to have helped me at all. Because what did I get from that? I got the newspaper. To the church. I feel like I missed something at the, the cross. I like the way it was before, though. <sighs> okay, what can we do? What can we do? What can we do? not anything here. Anything in this house? What's a newspaper?
want a speaker? No. You want to get some drinks? I don't know what my options are now. I'm missing a um let's talk to the not the old woman in the newspaper. Wait, do you like a speaker? No. Would you like some water? Would you like some fire? Would you want to go out for some drinks? Nope. Want to go fix a pipe? I'm missing an item.
don't know where to go to next. I feel like I need to distract Sinclair somehow. I feel like I've done all my options. Unless there's something in the forest that I completely missed, but I don't think so. Just have not seen anything else I could interact with. Do what can we do that we haven't done?
I may need to look it up because I have no idea at this point. Did I never tweet out my tweet? Oh my god, I never did. It was literally there queued up and I never tweeted it out. That is sad. Well, is YouTube working? you YouTubes. I thought you could just grab it once, but you can actually grab multiple times. And betray for Leo's mom. Looks like Sinclair held the funeral service back then. So you're a liar, a fibber. I'm pressing the wrong button. It's fine. Okay. So that's why I couldn't do nothing, because he was a lion, he was a fibbin. Game should only take an hour to beat. <laughs> the person that I saw on YouTube, they're. How far are they in? 20 minutes! <laughs> They're at the 20 minute point. Seems you had a funeral service for Lena Juskova. You remember what happened back then? Okay, listen. Do you have any idea how many of these services I've held over the years? Do you really expect me to remember every single one? I don't know what is it to you. You want what it is you want from me, but I can't help you. Now, how about you leave? All right, all right. That triggered him quite a bit. Can't shake the feeling that he knows more about it than he lets on. Okay, well that helped, but did it? do with an obituary. Oh, okay, that triggered something. Next generation, sorry about what we did to the planet. Hey, what's all this noise? Is your phone broken? Noise? What are you, a rock and roll grandpa? Uh, maybe a little. You look like the type. The phone's got crap speakers, but that doesn't make the song bad. Sounds more like video game noises. Yeah, whatever. Do you want a good speaker? Hey, do you want to hear your song in better quality? You can have my Bluetooth speaker for a bit. Nice, right, so hold on a second. Gotta connect. Okay, that does sound better. Turn the park into your own, very own disco. What? Disco? You mean like a club? Yeah, club. The disco text. You know the disco text.
What is this noise? Where's this ear piercing music coming from? Okay, at least you Im immediately recognize it as music. I can't work like this. This is my chance. We're gonna steal the statue, maybe. I don't think so. Steal the statue. Unlocked with this scrappy little padlock and chain. If it's locked. Can't even imagine what a strange and locked side room my church could be uh, could hide. Well, let's Okay, yep, that's this easier. It's the J-Man, and he's looking quite a bit whiter than he really was. Can we take it? Yeah. If I had a wet sponge and some time to spare. I can commit crimes for my boyfriend, don't judge. Aboard a wet color. That shit looks exactly like the one on Leo's photo. What is this all about? Ooh, heavy. Okay. Statue back, I guess. This thing I think you turn it a bit lower. Good luck, old man. This music, this is music that can only be uh, enjoyed at a certain volume. Is that when the ears fall off volume? Nah, it's this exact volume. Appreciate the sound <laughs> He complimented on my speakers. But this noise hurts both my ears and my mind. You gotta expand your horizons when it comes to music. Just be quiet and listen. Maybe you'll learn to appreciate it. Oh, he's gonna get down with the youth. I mean, I'll start to like shrill noises like this. It's never too late for new stuff. Listen. Just, okay. It's perfectly. Wow. Okay, this turned from normal to suddenly very not normal. Well, what is this place? Okay, it was all normy and then now it's not normy. Are we in heck? Oh no. Oh, this is well. You can see light at the bottom of it. 
These bricks are slippery and wet to the touch. Echo. Why did they have to be bones and who or what are they from? I feel too weird about touching the bone tree. Let's not. Who tied you together? It says, grief must drown the flames of anger. Move like a gravestone. Bluish bowl. Holding onto it tight. There, there's a point to the bowl. Red bowl. Yeah, it looks like he could use a hug. So what did that say? Grief must drown the flames of anger. So, water in the blue one. And the lighter in this one. Uh, if we put this in there. Then light it. goes out on that. Did I extinguish? Grief must drown the flames of anger. I thought it was just gonna be water and fire, but no.
Was there a different... So we had the pond. I have one more idea. This is gonna be weird though. I don't know if that's gonna be right. Unless we can get... Stuff in this well. I was actually gonna get that down here. Hey, what's wrong with your face? That's something great to ask someone. Okay, so can we avoid the Petrol lamp, judging by the smell. A petrol lamp. Petrol lamp. Oh, that's where we use the water. It's interesting how the ghost can only see you in the light. Window. 
looks like it's evening out there. Looks like it's a nice day outside. Okay, weird. Leo. And you still see that schlubby kid in his swivel chair. Looking like he spent all his allowance on tattoos and shit. That dude isn't holding down a job for sure. And he turns to the camera and says, Take out loans because the job revolution will come and it won't matter. And he says that ought to start shit at work and kick the boss's ass. Yeah, this kind of stuff is big with the kids these days. Not really surprised everything about jobs is kind of shit as it is. Yeah, the things we gotta do to get by, right? I mean, a lot of it sounds interesting, but... Then he calls us bootlicking for trying to do to make do. Saying we're not really people who he wants to associate with. But we're needed for the big revolution. That's not news to me. Heard it all before in my 20s. Not sure if it'll go anywhere this time. Don't really know much about the, those kind of politics. So hey Jeremy, you ever heard about stuff like this? You want to like get the guillotines ready? Uh, what am I doing back here? Burp. You got that right, bud. Yeah, but hold on, that's not. Okay. You gotta figure out what happened back then. If only I could remember. What happened? Okay, interesting. all the same. Let the bed with Leo go. Looks like Jeremy had one too many again. Nope. Okay, I think that's gonna be the same if I do the last one, but I may as well try it. That's what 10 beers in a row do to you. Take note, boys. Nope, okay. Okay, so I can't enter this room. I think I need to go back and ask what happened.
I gotta know something. I need to know what happened when my friend Leo came to get me. Oh, well. You were going on about political messaging or something. Then Leo came, and you tried to make him have a beer. You called him a name, and he stormed off. Hmm, okay, thanks. Are you doing okay? Yeah, everything's fine. See you tomorrow. Okay, we went into a different dimension. I don't know if that's fine. Hopefully that jogged our memory to what we needed. Okay, same stuff. Okay. Guess these folks often fuck up their messaging, pushing people away. That's not what he said. <laughs> okay. okay, I don't have to... You don't need to make me go through all of that again. We got so many exclusive clubs in the world already, there's no need for more. Look at us having serious discussions about politics while being really fucking drunk. It's like the alcohol makes everything so clear. Okay, so that was the right one. Nice hairdo, man. Love that that's a thing again. Thanks. It only take 15 minutes out of every morning. But it's indestructible once I'm done. Yo, Jeremy, let's get you home. You got the look. That means it's time. You want a beer too, guy? Nah, thanks. Gotta drive. Oh, come on, just one. Fucked it up, didn't I? We all are good. Yeah, come on, have a beer. Cute little pussy boy. Not cute little pussy boy. Oh my god. Not that. That's a new one. Did, did I say that out loud? God damn it, you always get like this when you're drunk too much. Can't be around you like that. Don't go home until you sober it up, okay? I can feel the emotion running hot. The air is crackling. Well, you heard the man. Give him another beer. Ah, oh, pussy boy. Yeah, I remember now. No wonder you left without me. Leo. Hey, so, did you really call me a cute little pussy boy? Well, in front of your colleagues? Yeah, sorry about that. You know, there's only one place where you can call me that. Yeah, I'll keep that in mind. I wouldn't- I draw the line of even in the bedroom. But what is this place? I'm not entirely sure. I think this is where my mother Lena is. 
I just don't remember how I got here. We don't have much time. I gotta see my mom. She's close as she's been calling me here. I might have been here... It might have been her that led me here too. Nothing else can explain the sock thing, right? The sock thing? It's, a uh, complicated. Let's save it for later. You take the lead, I'll follow for now. Alright, let's find your mom together. I was expecting him to call him a slur, just to, like... As if he wasn't gay. And I'm very much glad it didn't go that route. Because that is what I was expecting, and I'm glad it didn't happen. <sighs> Mama. Leo, you come. Hey, Ma. My little Leo. You brought your special one, too. I'm so happy you found love. I... Oh, darling, there's no need to look so sad. We have this special opportunity to see each other one last time. Let it be a happy moment. You're right. Have you been waiting for me all this time? Both you and Andric. Dad, too? Yes, but I can't find him out there anymore. That's not well. He has needed help for a long time. My Andric, so this is why. He made this place for me all those years ago. When my heart gave out but it's become corrupted it was so beautiful i thought we would all be happy together here when the time would come this place seems to be falling apart the corruption cannot be stopped i must move on or be forever lost in this shattered realm this brings us to a decision you must make a decision what do you mean you can return home with jeremy or you can come with me I could come with you. Yes, but it would be the end of your time among the living. Oh, this is... Oh, I don't know. I don't know what to say. That's it's really... Uh, that's not an easy decision. I gotta say nothing. I don't know about that. I'll go with you, Mom. I'm sorry, Jeremy. Are you sure about this? All we do is struggle, and every new day brings more challenges. I just can't anymore. But remember, it's not your fault. Life was never kind. It took my mom away. Dad is almost gone, too. All I want is peace for all of us. You were my light for a while, the best part of my life. Don't forget. I immediately regret that decision. It was nice to meet you, Jeremy. Don't remain here too long. This place will soon be gone. This this will be easy. Follow me, Leo. Wow, that I chose the a hundred percent the wrong one. Try to make their life better if you can. Goodbye. I'll miss you. I chose the wrong fucking option. Nothing can fix it. Love, money, or alcohol. So this is just... Well, hell, like many others have before you. All you need to do is ask. There's... There are those that'll listen. I'm gonna do the second ending. <laughs> I will not... Oh, is it not going to let me? Okay, how far back is this? Oh, this is pretty far. Oh, this is pretty far back. Oh, shit. <laughs> okay, I guess we got the bad ending. I don't know if that's the bad ending. I'm going to call it the bad ending. I didn't save when I should have saved. Oh, this is pretty far back. Yeah, that's pretty far back. How quickly could you, do you think I could get this? I think I could do it very quick. Okay, what do we have open? Do we have the, the house open yet? We don't have the house. How do we get the house? I forgot. 
<laughs> we show the picture to the old lady. Go to house. We only we also only got two cans. I also now remember that. Put the pipe in the door. And we didn't read this. Can't lever something open. Make the lever longer, right? Oh, okay. So that's what we do. And then we need to use. Oh, we need the ranch. We're getting this good ending. I also remember that I want to play Beanie today, so... <laughs> Today's stream's gonna be a little longer. The way this was supposed to be one hour. I think we need to go to church first. No, not the church. The do the thing first. Let's see if I remember where the socks go. Was it down or was it up? Oh, I can't remember. Go back to the church. Ask about the obituary and then... gets mad and then the kid should be outside we give him the speaker <laughs>
My cup has water in it, right? Yes. Why does Sinclair have the statue? There's that's a question that doesn't seem to be answered. Statue. No. Hopefully, I'm not wasting my time. We should save again. Paper. I'm really starting to worry if there's gonna be, if it's not just the final thing, but also what else, some other contributing factors outside of this. Okay. 
That's what happened. Okay, then you tell me what happened. Oh, I'm trying to rush through it, and then it's causing issues. Okay, we're going to save here. As I should have done before, I didn't even think about it. Okay, okay we know what happened here. Call him Pussy Boy. That's, I, I don't like that to begin with. Uh, and then all this, and then that, and then... Uh, it's like, you, did you really call me that? And it's like, yeah, and it's like, yeah, you, that was stupid. And my mom's like, do you want to go home? And it's like, I'm literally like 22. There's no way. Okay, please don't go, Leo. I... I'll go with you, Mom. He still goes?! What do you need to do? What do you need to do to make this not the ending? I think you have to complete everything. I don't know what else to do in this game.
What else do you do? Yes, there's a hole. He he tee he. There's got what else can I do? What else could I do? Let's see. I mean, there's some stuff. I guess you could get all the cans. Everything else seems to be complete, unless we go back to the church. We ask everyone what happened? Uh, I don't know. But I think that's all the time we're gonna spend with that. I'm gonna move on. And we are gonna play. Let me change the stream category. Because for now, we're gonna end it there. But we are gonna move on to a game called Beanie. Uh, so, a while back, I played M MacBat 64, um, Tori 3D, and then Tori 2, uh, which I really enjoy those games. And this is made by the same developer, and he made a uh, game in the style of Donkey Kong Country. And I'm actually quite shocked by how little games have this art style. Because... I, you would think so, and it, it repli replicates it so well. So it's a, it's a 2D platformer, uh, but you go vertically, and you're this rolling bee. So it's a really interesting, there's these spiky things. Are touching those bees bad? Or are they helpful? Uh, I hope to not find out. Yeah, it's kind of wild that, like, there haven't been too many games with this art style. With these pre-rendered graphics, you would think so. Because so I think it looks great. I guess it's not everyone's favorite. A lot of people really do not like the Donkey Kong Country style, uh of uh graphics i think it looks pretty cool always been a fan there we go let's keep these oh oh i think i pressed the wrong button kiwi's workshop oh kiwi so kiwi is come i believe it's slated for december so next month uh, but it's uh, the next 3D platformer, and I'm very, very excited for it. Now, who's the, the, the other one next to MacBat? Oh, hey there, Beanie. Listen, uh, could you do me a favor? See, I'm building a raft right now. I already got the best planks around from MacBat, and I'm lacking some good glue from them. Do you think you can bring me some of that special honey from the woods? Okay. I guess that's the motivation for getting different all this honey what's that oh are those ants like pulling me away that's cute so this game's also a dollar which I believe I can't remember if Tori 3D and Tori 2 were also a dollar. They may have been like a dollar forty nine or two dollars, but very cheap games for such a nice experience. And this plays extremely well, I have to say. It's very simple so far, but I don't feel like my controls are causing me any issues. And I'm going fast now. I'm really doing it. Oh, hell yeah. I think there was less enemies there, so I, I, oh, I keep pressing the wrong button. Um, I keep, uh, I was a little less cautious. Are you bad? Oh, you're bouncy. Okay, green bouncy bees.
Oh, I fell. Oh, oh they help you. Okay, that's it. That's actually really cool. But, so, is it actually possible to die? It might not be. Well, maybe from enemies, but not from falling, possibly. Oh. Yeah, I, still, I guess you can die from falling, which I guess is good, because I would have died, like, several times already. And also, I never like games where you're clearly going up, and then suddenly the... You die from falling. It's like, that doesn't make much sense. If it's a respawn, that's different. But just, like, straight up dying when you know there's ground beneath you and there's no explanation as to why you would die from that. I never like when games do that. Ooh. I keep pressing the wrong button. It's because I press the jump button confir to confirm all the time. And that's not the confirm button. There's a thing there. Oh, there's a, like a Gordo from Curbs. Speaking of which, Kirby was not nominated for any awards besides Family Game at the Game Awards, and I don't really consider the Game Awards to be that prestigious of an award show. Well, I don't consider any award shows to be that prestigious, but, like... I can still be mad about it. <laughs> like, Kirby was is legitimately my favorite game of the year. Like, I was wondering if Bayonetta 3 was going to beat it, and it did not. It didn't. I love Bayonetta 3, but it did not beat it. Kirby is still my favorite game I've played all year. It was so good, and I think it needs... I was like, I would give it... I would... <laughs> I would get... I would give it game of the year. Fully. Like, not even, like, as a joke. I would, I would give it game of the year. I don't think you have health. Am I on easy mode? Also, this music is extremely relaxing. That music was really nice. <laughs> I keep pressing the wrong goddamn button. Are there options? No. Music is so good. I wonder if Beanie's. I mean, I'm sure Beanie will be in Kiwi in some form. They love having uh, cameos in other games. MacBat is actually playable in, um, Tori. Oh. Yeah, the ones without enemies are easier, seemingly. Watch me fail tremendously. Wait, what's happening here? Oh! Oh, okay. That's what's happening. You can get on those platforms. Oh. Okay. Thank you. Y'all, y'all some dolls. I like how I can't fly, but they can. And, th and they're very, uh, supportive in my lack of flying. Is there anything above? It's weird that there's no collectibles. Kind of expected collectibles, but apparently not. Uh, ooh, okay, it goes down. Oh, okay. Oh, uh, uh, okay. Still good. Still good. Mm. <gasps> it's them. I forget what their names are. I think it's Regina and Matt. Mac and Regina. Always a cameo. So that game is developed by uh, the people who tend to port 
these games to Switch. Uh, and they have their own game. But I believe Regina Mac, which I always feel, um, it looks like it has good gameplay, but I just can't get past the graphics of it, which, you know, it's not my favorite thing to say in the world, but I just, I really can't. And that says a lot, because again, one of my favorite series, Epic Dumpster Bear, <laughs> uh, you would, you would think that wouldn't be an issue for me, but it just, I can't get past it and I, it's it's also just it's so flat and it just feels like there's there could be there just could be way more to it than it is but the actual gameplay looks good and i played like very very simple are you a baddie okay you know what i kind of forget that this is the tori developer and that Tori also does some really creepy stuff. And they just, like, are just gonna... I, I feel like one of these is gonna come alive. And I'm not happy about it. <laughs> they just like to throw in a little horror into our cute little bee climbing tree game. Yep, just some horror. Just something completely horrifying. For no goddamn reason. Should have played this during Halloween. I, did, I legitimately didn't know this was a, a thing in this game. But of course. Of course. Now I'm panicking. Now I'm panicking. Why? What? Why, why even? Why you do that? What was the reason? What was the reason? Oh, now we're just going to have some happy fun times after literally being chased down by death. Spikey's Revenge. Oh, this could be all the Spikey's then. This music is so good. I love it. This might be my favorite song. It's just so dreamy. It's not particularly winter to me. It, it does have a bit of winter vibes. But it's just very dreamy to me. when you get hit. Okay. I'm kind of glad there's no health and stuff in this game. There's no, like, actual fear of death, it seems.
Like, I guess it could get really frustrating very quickly. Um, oh, did, did I do it all? No. Should be way more. Oh, that is all the honey I need. Thank you so much, Beanie. Now I can finish my raft. See, there is this weird floating island in the middle of the ocean. I don't know where it came from, but I'm eager to take a closer look. Just wait here a moment. I have the raft going in no time. <laughs> Hello, Vel. Welcome. How are you doing? And so Kiwi finished the raft and made way for the strange floating island. Gaby, very much. <laughs> With a big round farewell, Beanie said goodbye to her friend. After a whole day of the ocean, the goal was finally in sight. The island in the sky floating above the dark and clear ocean water. But wait, what now? How do I get up there? Wondered Kiwi. Almost asked to answer his question. A big, growling gust of wind grabbed the raft and teared it apart. Kiwi got thrown, uh, thrown through the sky like nothing more but a leaf during an autumn storm. Everything turned dark for a while until Kiwi opened his eyes again and... A strange dog looked down on him and greeted him. Wakey wakey, eggs and bakey. I don't know how you got here, but welcome to the end of the world, laddie. Come on now, get up. I could really need your help. Oh! Oh my god! I did not know there was a 3D section in this game! Oh my god! Uh, I don't like these, uh... Controls. Oh, you know why? Because I have drift. Oh, that's not what I want. My drift is really drifting, and I'm like, I don't want to deal with that. I need to update. I need a. I need a new controller. Is essentially what needs to be said. There we go. But also. Why? I don't, I don't. I just don't like this camera in general. I'm not, I'm not gonna lie. It just is not how I want to be. I want. I want reverse. I have no idea why you fell from the sky, but there are more important things right now. There should be about five energy cells somewhere here. If you ever want to get off the island, you're talking way too fast. So you can't attack. At least you can run with ZR and turn the camera with the right stick. Okay. So this is like a little preview to Kiwi. Uh, I forget if it's called Kiwi 64. I think it's called Super Kiwi 64 actually. We collect these gears. There's Regina, Matt. We haven't seen Tori or we did see Mac Matt, but we didn't see. Is it Regina and Mac? I feel like it is, but I can't. But now that sounds wrong for some reason. Maybe it's Reginald and something else. And Mackenzie. Who knows? Camera be wild in. fall down there and then
Okay. So that was everything. Go back to the dog, I guess. Hey, got them. This will be, uh, this will help us a big deal. Come on, I'll show you a workshop and a way to get you back home. Kiwi story continued in Super Kiwi 64. Hell yeah, I think that comes out in, um, what's it called? December. This was cute, really cute, very quick. Enjoyed that very much. See you next game. With Kiwi Gone Adventure, Beanie decided to go for some extra challenge and collect the time medals in each level, including a completely new level. Cool. Okay, let's try one of the time levels. See what those are about. Well, Kiwi's not in the shop anymore, right? Kiwi's not here anymore. Wonder how his trip went. Who was the, the one on the right? I don't know the one on the right in that picture. It looks like a little alligator. Oh, I don't want to do this again. Oh, this is just to play this little demo again. It is, it is cool having a demo for another game. In a completely different style of the game. Okay, hopefully I can just exit this. I cannot just exit. You know what? We'll just close out of it. <laughs> okay, let me try the challenge. There's time at the bottom. I wonder if your bee friends are still there. Oh, damn it. I got scared. The snail scared me. did it. Okay. Now let's try this new level. Season friend. Oh, damn it. I keep pressing that wrong button. Season friend. <gasps> it's all Christmassy. How timely. I love this. I need more themed Christmassy game or levels and games. I left out in. Oh. oh no 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 no! Come back, baby, come back! Oh, I'm not gonna get this time. No! Oh, I almost have it! I almost have it! I almost have it! Yeah, okay. <laughs> okay. Um, okay, that is where we're gonna end it. Uh, that was cute. That's really cute. A really cute small game. Uh, both of the games I played today are only a dollar on the eShop, so if you want them, they're very easy to catch up. You might actually just have the gold points for them, actually. Uh, but yeah, I'm gonna end it there. I'll be back tomorrow. We're gonna play some... What's it called? Dead by Daylight. You know that game I play every week. <laughs> you can never remember the name of it. Uh, we're gonna play some Dead by Daylight. Um, on Wednesday will also be a double feature. It'll be uh, two games at once. Uh, I will play as well. Uh, they are both from the same series though. So you will see that. I, am, I also am streaming on Thursday. I pre-ordered Pokemon Violet. It will not get here until next Tuesday. So more than likely, I'm going to move things around 
and actually not have DVD next Tuesday and have play Pokemon on that day. And it might be later in the day, depending on when it actually gets delivered. But yeah, I'm going to end it there. Thank you all so much for hanging out with me. And I will see you all in the next one. Bye.